What's going on? Average Tech Guy here, and today we are back. More tech, more views. And right here in front of us is my iPad Pro M4. This is a 13-inch model, and last week I made a video and we talked about Procreate and basically how it wasn't working with my Apple Pencil. We went through a few different tests, and this is my Apple Pencil Pro. And we basically said, hey, this is not working. It worked in Notes, it did other little things, but in Procreate, it was not working. So let's talk about what's going on this week. All right, so um, let's just jump right into it because I told you that all the little nuanced features of hovering over your photo in Procreate will actually allow you to see the creative process. But we came to a point where when you actually went into procreate it would not draw so what i did now i did not update my ipad i did not update procreate i did not do anything extra i turned my device off i disconnected this i did it a few times and another day or so later came back in and procreate was working so it now works with my Apple Pencil. So with that being said, all of the features that we talked about that we wanted as far as your tilt and as far as your pressure sensitivity, very, very light against very, very dark. Once again, very light against very dark. All those things now work and once again, uh, they will be updating Procreate to take advantage of everything that the Apple Pencil has to offer. Squeeze does not do anything, but you can see there is a cursor on the screen without me touching it. In order for you to activate the color panel, the cursor has to be available. So I do have it if I double tap, but if the cursor is not available on the screen, it won't work. So the cursor has to be close enough to the display so that it picks up and you will update and activate that color palette. Be able to choose what you want, come back over here and just draw it out. So we are now working. We are almost at full speed with this device. Just felt that we give you guys an update because I didn't want to feel like I was bashing Procreate or bashing anybody. I just want to be 100% transparent with everyone. This is now working. And now we can get back to sketching, drawing, and doodling just like so. Now, once again, remember the squeeze does not work still. So that part is still not fixed. We still don't have an update for that. But if you get close enough to where you can see that cursor and you double tap, it does reveal the color panel. So just a little update so we can help everybody out. Until next time, and if you want to know more about this stand, I'll be sure and drop a link below. It's from the company Binks. Um, it is actually a nice device. If you want to see a full review on it, I'll go back. I think I already talked about it in a video, but I've been using this one a lot since I got the iPad. <laughs> it goes to multiple heights, multiple angles. Um, very helpful device. And it's super sturdy as well. So I'll drop a link below. If you want to see more about this, I'll probably do like a full accessory roundup. We'll talk a little bit more in depth about some of these accessories that I have, because this is one over here as well that I just got in brand new from Tom Talk. We'll definitely talk about that. But until next time, Average Tech out. Peace.